guys. Welcome back to Catherine's Corner with This Is Us Now. Today we're going to talk about some Mary Kay products. And to help me with that, I have my dearest girl, Tanya. I'm here. Because National Ice Cream Day is this coming Sunday. Excuses to eat ice cream, okay? Yes. <laughs> okay, so... Um, this is start with. Yes. We're talking about your flawless face, right? Yes. Foundation primer. Everyone who uses foundation knows the importance of this. Yes. And you do want to make sure you prime your face first. That's after your moisturizing step. It has SPF 15 in it, and it stops the sun's aging your skin and burning your skin. UVA, UVB, right? And then it also helps the oil from breaking through, so it gives you a nice matte finish. It feels like ground rose petals. It's so sexy when it goes on the face. Y'all will love it. I can't wait to hear your first impression of it. Me neither. I'm very excited to try these products. So we're gonna move on to the next the boom, the main attraction today, and that's Mary Kay's foundation. You're gonna be applying it with a dampened sponge. And when you try it at home, you're gonna be applying it with a dampened sponge. Can't wait to see how much you look. No, don't wanna be by and you got to use it's got the pointed tip for the smaller areas and it's got the uh, round ovalness easy to hold to do the stippling effect as you're putting on your foundation to have a smooth even application of this time-wise 3d foundation oh and you're beautiful in your beige 180 by the way oh thank <laughs> you you're welcome you're welcome so um 12 hours of wear 12 hours of wear so you will absolutely love it it's breathable it's um transfer resistant it's amazing okay Another secret to keeping your face flawless with amazing foundation, Mary Kay that is, is your translucent powder or your set. You know about setting powder, yes. right? Yes. You, you need gotta. to have the setting powder after foundation, Absolutely. girls. Absolutely. You have to. It's a must. <laughs> awesome. And after that, you can just do a little finishing spray, even though you haven't started the color when you start applying these foundation products because you want to set that flawless look and then you can build the color. So. I'm excited to hear Thank your you first very impressions. Much. Yes. Okay, guys. So I hope you guys enjoy this video of my first impression using these Mary Kay products. Mm -hmm. Okay, guys. So I'm going to start off by using the primer, and it's called Mary Kay Foundation Primer. So let's see how it goes. And the bottle looks like. you know ready to apply the foundation and I really do like it I honestly think you guys should try it out um, the textures kind of like I don't know if you guys have heard of Vaseline it kind of feels like that but it, well like honestly how it just seems it's so smooth and so ready to just apply your foundation I love that I really do. So I do recommend the primer, the Mary Kay primer. I recommend that to you guys for real. Now I'm gonna be using the Mary Kay <coughs> blending sponge, and it looks like this. So guys, when you use a sponge, just please make sure to damp it. You wet it. Wet your sponge. And I'm just using a cup of water, so it's, it's water. Once you do that, I'm going to be using the foundation Mary Kay Time Wise. It's a matte 3D foundation, um, and it looks like this. 
and I'm using the color beige 180. Okay, so let's see how this goes. So I'm gonna put some on my hand like this. And now with my beauty blender, I just put some right there, and then I just go in. Okay guys, so this right here is my face with foundation, without it. Mm. Girl, I'm really liking this foundation, like what? Let's do the other side, the other side. <laughs> Okay, so once I'm finished with that, I'm gonna go in with the setting powder. But one thing I really want to say about this foundation is that, girl, this foundation right here and this little tube it's just amazing like for real it's amazing I really like the foundation I like how it looks it leaves your skin just so pretty okay so now I'm gonna go in with the um, setting powder let me move you guys this side let me get So, I'm going to go in with the setting powder, and the setting powder is called Translucent Loose Powder. I call it setting powder, I don't know, there's so many names, you can call this powder. And so when I open the, bo the bottle, or the little thing, look at this guys. <laughs> so it doesn't fall. This actually has like a little thing where you close it and you open it. So you open it and you close it. I think that's very unique. I mean, not a lot of setting powders have that little um, have that little thing where you know it it um, closes and opens. So that's very unique of it. So I'm just gonna go in with. My, I'm gonna go in with the Mary Kay All Over Powder Brush. And I'm gonna dig in. I'm going to be using the Mary Kay Finishing Spray. It looks like this. This is just to set your makeup. So now I'm just going to go in and spray some so far. Here we go. 
welcome back guys and that was my video my first impression and i want to really say thank you oh. tanya for being here for having you know making this happen for me oh thanks for having me thank you for sharing uh the opportunity giving me the opportunity to share the products yeah. um and so if anyone's interested in what we uh what you saw Catherine use in her first impressions video look in the description See how to get this product from me, Tanya Munro Finley, Independent Sales Director with Mary Kay Cosmetics. Yes, so y'all just heard that. And before I end the video, I do want to let you guys know that I am doing a makeup challenge. Wow, so cool. stay tuned for that because that's my next video. Um, it's going to be very fun. It's a makeup challenge, and I just hope you guys enjoy it. And so don't forget to subscribe and get, get us awesome. up there and out there, like Brittany said. That's good. And um, so again, just a quick uh, review. The next episode will be a This Is A Tell uh, makeup challenge where Catherine will be blindfolded and we'll do uh, Amber's makeup and vice versa. And just stay tuned for that episode that's gonna come out soon. And again, Tanya, thank you for being a guest. Yes, now. That's cool, I loved it. Um, we will see more <laughs> products of Mary Kay and this is not the last episode we will see of Tanya. Wow. We'll see much, much, and much more out of her awesome. and stay tuned for the next Catherine's Corner uh, next week and just keep yourself updated on what products she's going to share <laughs> next <laughs> bye guys